What's going on everybody? So today we went out fishing on a cloudy summer morning and I wasn't planning on throwing finesse, but hey, that's what happened. And we're gonna get right into that. Great day of fishing. Highly recommend this bait. Uh, it's called the Flash Arrow J Split. It's great, catch a lot of fish. It's pretty cool. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button and let's get fishing. been a while. Got one. It's not a bad one either. Let's go, dude. Finesse. Who would have guessed? I guess me. Oh, yeah. Thank you, Mama. Look at that fish. That tiny little, tiny little fluke finesse jig. Catches a big old four pounder. Yes, sir. Look at that fish. Oh, tired that one out for sure. Is it a pattern? I don't know. Let's freaking go, dude. Look at this thing. Look at this fish. It's another one I can dip my fist in. Yeah. 4.9. Yep. Oh, it's a five pounder actually. Five on the dot. Let's freaking go, dude. Five pounder on finesse. Gotta love it. Thank you. Switch from the frog and the swim bait. Tiny little fluke. You get Bertha right here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. All right, let's do some more of that. A little flash arrow, finesse fluke. Sir. Yes, sir. Let's go back over the area that we were just at then. Sometimes you got to downsize. It went from a uh, excessive heat wave. It went from an excessive heat wave to a cold front. And uh, I don't know, kind of feels like fall, even though it's not. So you know how we have fake springs, we might have a fake fall condition right now. But let's find out. Let's keep fishing this and see if we get more. Because that one, had a clean tail and a fat belly, so it's been eaten and it's not spawning. It's a good sign. You know, post spawn, but he was in, or she was in a spot that you'd normally expect a, uh, like this little pocket is where she was. And it's where you think um, fish that are uh, pushing bait into corners would be. Probably what she was doing, to be honest. Finesse is fun, dude. You get that freaking fight, especially with five pounder like that. Made a couple of runs from me. So I said five on the dot. It was four, nine, six. We'll, we'll call that five. Four, nine, six is basically a five. <laughs> Just to set the record straight. We're just uh, mid strolling this. Hover strolling, mid strolling, that technique that all the dudes with fish finders do. Works without a fish finder if you know where the fish might be. 
Let's see. Doesn't feel bad. Doesn't feel like that one we just got. Yeah. It's like a two pounder. Boat flip this one on 10 pound line. Yes, sir. Thank you. A little two pounder. See how long we can use this plastic for. We've got limited number of them. It's a little better than that last one we just had. It's got some big head shakes. That's a decent one. <coughs> one that you also. <coughs> We're on him. Yep. Another like two and a half pounder. Came out pretty easily that time. These fish are fat, feeding up on bait fish. See you later, Jimmy. Sheesh. Right here, flash J split, four inch. We've got one, two, three, four, five of them left. Three fish on one though. It's pretty good, honestly, for the average lifespan of these guys. <laughs> Seems like there's a decent amount right here over between these two pieces of wood. So we're liking that a little deeper today. Yeah, so for this, basically you cast it, let it sink a little, and you just jiggle it. Retrieve, jiggle, and then when you feel weight, you just set the hook. Because normally when you feel weight, it's either you're in a wood, piece of wood, or a fish is swimming with it. Fish. It's another decent one. We found a spot that's working and a technique that's working. Can't stop now. Found a pattern. Yep, another two pounder. Thank you, Jim Bob, for not messing up my plastic again. One pounder. Oh. Fix our plastic. Small guys always tear this crap up. I think that was number five. First one under two. See how this allure does at the starting spot where the jig bite normally is. And jig bites off. Maybe they're there, but deeper and chasing smaller bait fish. Now I'll say this lure also does not look like anything that I've seen in this reservoir before, but it is a perfect tiny bait fish size. All right, work this wall since it's been good over there. Give those fish a second to calm down. See if we can't get snagged over here. 
There we go. Smaller head shakes. Another one pounder. Back you go. Just let the wind take us. There we go. That feels like a better one. Yep. It's a better one. On the boat. Another nice one. <clears throat> Another maybe four pounder. Oh yeah, that wasn't coming out. Unless the line snapped. I was right in the bone. Yes sir, look at this guy. Let's get a win on him too. 3.6. A 3.6, boys. Let's go. Hell yeah. Back down she goes. Definitely found a pattern here. Eating tiny bait fish. How's our lure looking? Completely useless yet? Yeah. Face on this thing is all tore up. Got four more. Seven fish on two of them. Pretty good. I may get to go see Deadpool with my friend today. And I may save some money by not being out here for eight hours. Keep doing this till it dies. Sure Jimmy will be happy to hear that I found a pattern. Jimmy, our friend, not Jimmy the fish. Jimmy the fish is not happy that we found this pattern. But so far we haven't caught any Jimmys. We've just caught respectable, decent sized bass except for a couple of one pounders. Little dinker. Ah. Not the smallest, but nowhere near big or nothing like that. Thank you. Pooped all over my hand and my, ugh, he pooped on me. Literally a stinker. Another smaller one. Come here. Come here. Don't poop on me. You've heard of don't tread on me? Now you've heard of don't poop on me. Oh, that's a stick. First stick of the day. I'm surprised it's the first one. After we get a stick, we catch a tree. That's destiny. Down to our last three. Certainly has been a fun morning. Glad that we found the pattern for the past hour and a half. Don't know how much longer they're gonna be on this pattern, but it's a fun one.
screw you. There you go. Back you go. He's bleeding, so just get him back quick. Some of them are still chasing bait. That's good to know. Small one. Chimbub. I'm gonna go back to where we started, try that first cove, and uh, call it a day. We had a pretty good day. Why pay more money when we uh, already accomplished the best bite, best window. Found the pattern until it died. Maybe it didn't die, maybe they're just not over here. But we'll go find out, we'll see when we get there. All right, y'all, we're gonna wrap it up. Short day today, good, really good bite window in the morning, and then it died, so we're not gonna stick around, pay more money, we got our money's worth, and it was a finesse pattern. They were feeding on bait early morning, it was pretty cool, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and we will see you next time. Peace. Headshot. All right, I guess I wasn't recording, but we already got our first fish, it's about a two pounder. Just doing the same thing I was doing yesterday. There we go. This one's a little better, I think. Can you get the net? Yeah. Maybe four? Stay away from that motor, buddy. Heck yeah. Three, I'd say. I just finished, I just finished tying. <laughs> <laughs> yep, right in the top of the mouth, perfect spot in the bone. Really annoying to get out though, there we go. So uh, yeah, it's a small, small hook. Heck yeah, second fish. First fish on camera today. Let's go, fat belly. They're definitely eating stuff down there. That's for sure. Noise. <laughs> it is kind of. Oh, I did get tagged. Yeah. I saw your rod and I was like, I think. Ooh, that's a good one. Oh, that is a good one. It's better than I thought it was. That one I get is closer to four. That's about the size of the one I got uh, a few weeks ago. Nice. Thank you. This is all pretty good fish so far. <laughs> <laughs> I thought last uh, time we were here, it was pretty damn good. <laughs> it's funny, it's like on a complete different presentation this time than what we were doing yesterday. Got this fish here, it's the first one we're gonna weigh today. Last one was maybe three, but this one could be close to four. Tail is a little skinny, but he's got a fat stomach. Three point five nine. He's got a big head. Three point six, yeah, he's got a fat head. He's got a bit of a belly, but his shoulders and tail are kinda skinny. Mm hmm He's long though. See you later, Rachel. I don't know why. It's your name. It's Rachel. Have a good life. <laughs> Tiny. He's the guy who's gonna ruin my lore. There we go. Get him back as quick as possible. Here we go. Jimmy, but I'll take it. Hell yeah. Hold it. 
All right, I caught one at least. Nice. <laughs> left my phone in the car. Do you know what time it is? 8.04. Kind of want to test my theory of if this works at the other spot I'm thinking of. Okay. Are you down for that? Yeah, I'm down for whatever, man. Cool. <laughs> All right, let's see if we can zoom there in time. Now, now we're on. Okay. Hey guys, left the camera off again, but I'm throwing the fluke still. This guy inhaled the little jig again. Probably a nice upper two. Where did my long pliers go? Alright, we gotta find these pliers. We're going to make sure that he's fine. We're going to move the boat, see if we see him. And if we do, we're going to revive him more. But as far as I can tell, I think he went back down. I think he did. OK. I didn't hear him hit the boat. Cool. He's just a little tired. If your hook gets stuck and you don't know what to do, take a moment, put the fish back in the water, because the water coagulates their blood. So. Their best chance of survival is as long as you keep them in the water, they won't bleed more. So, a little bit of fish advice. It's unfortunate that that happened, but I think he'll be okay as long as he goes down into that deep water. We were just over probably 60 feet, so he can go suspend in some cooler water and catch his breath essentially. But uh, yeah, it's fishing, happens sometimes. But we're gonna get back to it, catch a few more. Yeah. Camera's on this time. <laughs> Excellent. Fish. Nice upper twos again. Back he goes. It's not that big. Got 10 pound test on here. Go, Jim Bob. He flung a little bit of poop around when he was going back down. It's the fail safe. Bigger head shakes on this one. Oh yeah, They're not giant, but a good one. Yes, sir. Thank you, Jim Bob. Little Bobby. There he goes. This one's a little better. He's staying down. Oh yeah. I saw the white when you caught it because he was in the showers. Ooh.
I guess my theory was correct. correct. All right, y'all. Biggest fish off this wall. It's not very long, but he's but she's fat. It's got a big head, short body. That's how I like him. 3.14. 3.14. Can ask for more. Who's keeping score? Not me. with the motor I don't know about this one it's not giving me too much feedback oh that's pretty good it's pretty all right waking up now yeah Oh. Yeah, it's teamwork. It's making the dream work. Two pounder. Let's see if a split tail zoom fluke works as well as the fish arrow. Something about that last lure that was just special. It had a very uh, nice realism to it. Yeah, and I think that little piece of foil on the inside really does something for these fish if they're eating small bait. Yeah. And then it's kind of like an, the appeal of an underspin, but it can just stay in one place for so much longer. I'll try the jig. Haven't thrown a jig yet today. Oh, there's a fish that has it. Good. Yeah, I don't know what it looks like. <sighs> Snag. Swam into a tree. Yeah, swam into a tree because I wasn't paying attention. Nice. Nice. Heck yeah. Jimmy He's down deep. Ah, he spined me. About the size of the one that's behind me. Must have been his brother. <laughs> <laughs> Woodpecker. Yep. Pecking at some wood. Nice. Another Jimmy. Oh, that is actually decent. Like. He woke up. <laughs> yep. <laughs> He was fighting real, like... Timid? Timid until, kind of like how the fish have been to today. Cool. Alright. I'll take it. Yeah, Two that's pounds. a nice... That's upper twos. Yeah. Because last time we went was the first time in years. Yeah, that's a pretty nice one. A little belly on him? Yeah. I like this cove. <laughs> <laughs> My first five pounder was on a 90 degree day in November at a pond in San Jose by the Bass Pro. Oh, okay. Those ones that are right across the way? Underneath the bridges. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Can you, I, I've seen those. I didn't know you could fish them. Nice. This is a good one. Okay. Oh, yeah, it is. Woo! This might be my. We'll see, we'll see. Oh, yeah. This. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, let him play. Yeah, loosen my drag just a hair. Oh, 
I'm not gonna net till he's up and takes a pause. Okay, he's like four plus, he ain't five. Oh, but it's still a good fish. Woo! <laughs> I feel good. <laughs> nice. <laughs> It's your cove, man. Yeah, it's the best fish of the year for me. Yeah, he's skinny. If he had a belly, he'd be five. It's like... <laughs> okay. Oh, did you spit it out? Yep. Yeah. Nice. I feel way better about that. I always yeah. feel bad about leaving a jig. Yeah. Yeah, I saw him spit that jig like I saw the black thing just fly out. Because he can eject from within, but if you pull, it's like... Yeah. Yeah, so that's cool. Fish is all good. Alright, I'm, I'm pretty happy. Nice. <laughs> Historically, the cove on the other side has been a good spot for me also. So we shall try. Fished up and down here pretty good. I lost uh, one that I didn't see here um, two weeks ago, throwing a jig. It was right underneath the boat, so I must have just pulled it straight out of its mouth when I set the hook. Uh, it is pretty impressive. I've had it stay connected in like 70 mile an hour gusts. Nice. Okay. I didn't think it was a fish. I thought I... I, I, I saw you like lift and think about it for a second. Nice. Yep. Might be a little bigger than the one you caught back there. It's fat. Can't right tell about the length, but its head looks. Yeah. It's a BP5 layer. Beefy five layer burrito fish. Definitely have a burrito after this. Nice. Oh yeah, it's definitely bigger. This is over four hundred percent. I have to reweigh him because he was shaking when I first uh, stopped shaking. Three point nine. Oh, right <laughs> on the nose. Right. Beauty though. Like a, looks like a cigarette burn almost, right? Yeah. Nice. It's the big fish of the day. You caught, I thought you caught a four. I caught a 3.6. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, you got seven fish now. And I caught somewhere around 10, but you got the biggest fish of the day. And if you've been liking these videos, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and we will see you next time.